Okay, welcome to the channel. This is going to be a super quick video. So thanks to the Determined Runner and from What What I Learned from Cancer, two great YouTube channels. I have now been nominated to do the hashtag my run. I'm going to try and answer these five questions as quick as I can because I think I've got three minutes, so I won't go on. Go, won't go on long, too long. I'm going to take a camera out with me right now. I'm going to go for a run and answer the questions best I can. Right. See you in a second. So why do I run? I've got to keep the sample as quick as possible, but. The number one reason probably would be the mental, uh, the mental state it leaves you in. Just, it helps to alleviate any sort of anxiety, worry. It just puts all the neurotransmitters in the right place. It just makes you feel good, it makes you feel happy. It makes you just feel, yeah, this sort of psychological impact of running for me is probably one of the main reasons. Now, there are loads more. I've actually done another video, which I'll put up later on about more reasons why I run, but I've got to be honest, that's my number one main reason why I run is because how it makes me just calmer, better, just a nicer person as well. So, yes. So question two would be, what piece of advice would I give to new runners or other runners? I can't remember the exact question. Uh, I'd have to say, go for, uh, wear bright colors. Wear bright colors and clothes. It's been scientifically proven to make you faster. I'm only kidding. Um, I would say, bad joke um wasting time too i would say fuel your runs um fuel your runs and recovery and even in training runs just make sure because i went way too long thinking faster runs were better for me and everyone's different by the way but thinking faster runs are great you know low carb all that non well all that stuff which works for some but for me i've definitely found and i've said it before fueling my runs fueling my week as well uh, helps me not only with my training runs, my races, but also recovery. So just don't worry about too many of the fad diets out there or too many of the smart ideas. Stick to the basics, learn how your body works, trial and error. But most important thing is get those calories in. Your body needs carbs to run efficiently. Well, for me anyway, to help oxidize fat properly, to keep the brain happy. Just, yeah fuel your training. Question three, which I think it is, what was my first running event? I think my first official running event was the London Marathon in 2005. I actually just went in kind of blindly, but I put, came out with 3.19, three hours, 19 minutes, um, and it went well, actually. Uh, I didn't hit, really hit a wall. I didn't really know what I was doing, but I just smashed it. And I couldn't really walk for a week afterwards, but that was it, it's the first event. London Marathon 2005. Okay, so question four. I think it is, what was your most ambitious yet achievable running event? Um, it's a tricky one to answer, but I suppose my most ambitious, yet achievable, oh, I suppose the longest run I've done, which is the 108 kilometers around the Isle of Wight. Certainly not the best run I've done, but I guess most ambitious, because it was the longest, which isn't, which isn't the most exciting answer, but yeah, um, it might lead me on to my next question though, so I'll leave that one there. So I guess the last and final question is, what is, hang on, which way am I going here? What is the, uh, what's your dream goal, dream event? Um, what's the sort of the biggest thing you'd have in the pipeline? Um, I don't really know, it's tricky. I mean, UTMB, those ones are awesome, the CCC. Uh, so I guess, to, to do the event North Downs Way, which I played for last year, which I got, but I couldn't quite do because of, um, hold on, I'm just, stop. So I think probably the North Downs Way 100 is my, it's my goal race that I want to do because A, it's achievable, B, it's on my doorstep. So I've got a good connection to that race. So I'm, I know it quite well and I think I owe it to it. Owe it to it? Owe it to do it. Um, so yeah, so North Downs Way 100, Centurion Race, which I did have in the books for last year, but I couldn't do uh, because of all sorts of different reasons, travel, COVID, blah de blah, blah um, and that's it. Right, so those are the five questions which I've kind of answered. I kind of hope I got the questions all right. I didn't scuff them up too much. Um, yeah, that's it, right. Thank you, oh, I've got to nominate. Uh, Jeff, Dose of Dirt, great channel, check him out. Uh, Lloyd from Run for Adventures. 
I'd love to see why he, what he would say for those questions. And lastly, Joan from The Unlazy Way, which is an awesome channel. Hopefully you'll do it, you never know. Um, that's it. Hope I didn't mess those questions up. I think I might have scuffed up the last one or two a little bit, but anywho, hope that kind of helps, entertaining, and yeah, gives you a tiny insight to my running history. That's it, bye.